Hey, I'm Dan. And I'm Jared, and we're Augustana, and you're listening to the 24 Hour Podcast. T minus four, three, two, one. The following is a 24 Hours Podcast. Dan and Jared from Augustana, first of all, welcome back to Vancouver because we had the chance to speak a few months ago. How has the tour been since you were last in town? Uh, it's been amazing. I mean, we just started back on uh, on this headlining run just like this last week, and uh, it's been all these shows have been really fun. A lot of kids have been coming out and stuff, and it's great. We get to play a lot of new stuff and some old stuff. So, yeah. Do you see the momentum building a lot? Like, I mean, when you play a city for the second time, obviously it's before the show tonight, but you know, when you come back a second time, do you see that there's been a more groundswell of support? I mean, people are more excited about your return visit? Yeah, yeah, definitely. I mean, uh, Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> I think, uh, and yeah, and the more, the more you keep coming back, I think, you know, it grows and grows and people talk and stuff. And uh, hopefully, you know, the live show is something that, you know, we're pretty, pretty stoked on that the people will come to see. You know, um, after they've heard the record, or even if they've heard a song or whatever, you know, we hope the live thing is a, a different experience for them. So it's definitely, um, definitely fun to have people, more people, come out to that. Uh, Dan, tell us what's uh, what's life on the road been like? You guys are spending a lot of time together. Is it uh, is it a learning experience about uh, you know, each and every one's individual quirks and quirks? Yeah, I mean, it's a. Uh it's always an experience, you know, to spend that much time with somebody. But uh, I think we all really enjoy each other's company, and we all have a really good time together. And you know, nobody really ekes anybody over or anything. So we, I think we got a good group of guys, and uh, we all, we all, you know, just play video games and talk trash about Madden and <laughs> you know all that stuff, and play shows and have a good time. You know, any uh, any hard and fast rules on the bus? Anything, anything forbidden on the bus? I mean, smoking, but none of us smoke. Uh, <laughs> well, I don't know. I mean, not really. It's pretty it's much open pretty game. It's just, yeah, you just kind of, you know, everybody's pretty respectful of just what, just standard rules, you know. <laughs> a, lot, a lot of bands have a no number two policy on the bus. Is that? Well, yeah, yeah. Is that, is, that a, is that a standard thing in music? It's not just because, well, it's not, it's not just because the smell. I think it's also because of um, the actual, I don't know, sanitation issues i think <laughs> just because you can't dump it's really hard to get to a place to dump a bus you know or an rv or whatever you know so i think you know or else you end up like dave matthews or whatever <laughs> dumping it over the river on people's heads you know so i don't know i guess that's why now we just saw you recently on uh on letterman you're still touring around the the, the album all the stars and boulevards which is a solid record uh, you know obviously boston is still a main focus track um, what's coming up from the album? What, are we, what can we expect video-wise, single-wise, in the next little while? Uh, we got, um, I, I believe we're looking to put out Stars and Boulevards, the title track, um, out for the second single. Um, if not, it'll be Wasteland. Uh, but uh, it looks like we're talking to directors right now about um, the video for Stars and Boulevards, and uh, we're just kind of exploring all the options. and kind of seeing what we can do with that and some radio stations are starting to play it uh, you know here and there so yeah so so you will not be on a piano in the water for another video <laughs> how how was that to shoot was, was it tough yeah you know it was a little tough it was really fun it was it was, but it was um it was definitely a trying experience you know it was it was I don't know how you guys feel about cold water up here in Vancouver. But we talk. We talking shrinkage. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. I mean, but it was it was definitely like you know it was January in the Pacific Ocean, you know, off California, which you know isn't but freezing, but it's definitely definitely pretty cold, you know. So you know, and spending the whole the whole day or two in there, you know, from morning till night, you know, it's definitely a little cold. <laughs> uh, Jared, tell us the origin of the name Augustana. Is there anything significant about the band's name? Uh, not particularly. It was just kind of a name uh, that was kind of suggested to us, to us, and we uh, we liked it, so we kind of went with it. <laughs> and finally, what uh, what kind of support have you had from Canada? I mean, are you got you got a lot of Canadian MySpace friends and a lot of support in Canada? Yeah, I mean, Canada has been really, really, really good to us, um, especially at the shows. Everybody's really just vocal and. It's loud, and they just really enjoy hearing hearing the music and stuff. So that's been it's been always fun to come up here and just have that really warm reception from Canadians. Twenty four hours. Ca.